Hey everybody, welcome back to the O Ship Show. On today's episode, I am doing, so I know usually this is where Sonic Chronicles comes up or the video game of the week. So we're gonna do a little review of some of the games that I've gotten because I am so lucky. I live near a used game store. And since I'm doing my little series on DS, I got some DS games. So I'm super excited about it. I'm not gonna show you guys all of them, but I am gonna show you some of the ones that we're gonna do soon. Because guys, I hope you, because as you guys know, one of my favorite YouTubers on, on YouTube is Super Horror Bro. He is such a huge inspiration to me and I love all of his content. So I kind of want to follow a little bit in what he's done and I want to do some videos about the like lore, about the content, story content, character explained, all of that. I want to do that for Sonic Chronicles. So I will be doing that. It might come out every two weeks or so, but every other week, probably on the opposite of the ass schedule, we'll do, we will have a video like that. I'm still figuring that out. It's a process, but as that's happening. We will also, hopefully, we'll see how we'll see how quickly I can get this back up and running. We will play some other DS games because, as you guys know, when I first played Sonic Chronicles, I so guys, when I first picked up Sonic Chronicles, it was because it was my it was one of the hardest games in my DS collection, which is not which is I thought that that was true. That's not true. This game is the hardest game in my DS collection. If you know, you know. It's, if I know that picture might be a little blurry. Star Wars The Clone Wars. Annoyingly hard game, especially with the RT, R2-D2 sections. So we def, like I think we're gonna sprinkle in. <laughs> so guys, my plans in Sonic Chronicles. That, the first time that was published was February 2nd. Yeah. And the last video went up Jan June 8th. At least the actual, actual playthrough. That's a really long time to play a video game, especially because even though there were like roughly 15 videos, give or take, I did it once a week. So I'm thinking for the next game that we do, we're going to do a smaller game to save me some effort. So we're gonna mix it in. The next two games that we are going to play are technically not sequels, but like same developer, same name. They're basically, they're, they're sequels. But before we dive into that, I want to show you guys some of the other games that we'll be playing. Because the ones that I, we, I do want to play all the ones from my original set of DS games. As you guys can see, this was the case I had when I was younger. My DS, and I had six games. So we will be going through all six games. The one where this is missing, that's Sonic Chronicles. The reason why I only kept six, I used to have a bunch, because like, that's all I wanted was DS games. And I actually still have two more, but... The big reason why I only had six was I actually sold a lot of my DS games. This video needs to have more of a consistent point, <laughs> but I wanted to show you guys at least, I'm not gonna show you all of them. Cause I wanna do a video where like, I kinda like to, where I do a season where I'm like, hey, this game is coming to the channel. Cause I don't exactly know how long this new game is gonna take. Cause I haven't played it in like a half a minute. Sorry guys, we're also playing Fetch during this video. Cause we <laughs> Okay, so. But yeah, so I'm gonna tell you guys a little bit about some of the games that I'm really excited about. Someone just followed, followed me on TikTok. There, thank you. <laughs> Can you give me the ball? Can you give me the ball? He's not gonna give me the ball. So we won't play all of these on the show cause like some of them, I don't know how to play. I don't know how to record myself playing Xbox, but I have it now. So there's a couple of games that I wanna show you guys and I'm actually, Okay, I'm actually gonna show you guys the games that we are going to be playing the soonest. So the soonest, <laughs> soonest games. We are going to go to a couple of classics because I wanna do a story explained video on all these games. And the reason why I wanna do that, besides the fact of my love for Super Horror Bro, is because it'd be kinda nice to like actually go back. Oh my God, I have two. Oh my god, I gotta show you. Okay, so I was looking through the games I have. Ah! First of all, I bought one game twice. We are definitely going back and reselling Star Wars The Clone Wars, because I bought you twice. Oops. I needed to make sure I had it. I thought I sold it. That game could sell pretty penny. But, guys, I have, so, fun fact about me that you guys might not know, 
And yes, that black blob in the background is my dog. He is currently eating up a blanket that I made for him, by the way, that he's still punk, punk ass. But fun fact about me, one of my favorite movie series that I think is an absolute gold mine is the Kung Fu Panda series. And I think I did this subconsciously, but I have Kung Fu Panda 1 and Kung Fu Panda 2 on the DS. We are doing this and I will cry at all times. Because Kung Fu Panda 2 is, like this movie is superior to the first one. Not by much, because this movie, this is the first one, top 10 amazingness. But the second one is just, I love it. Third movie is okay. That's all I'm gonna say about that. It was just okay. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't seen the TV series because I never quite trust the TV series version, especially when it's not animated the same way. I don't touch those because it's just, mm. but yeah. So these are two of the games. These guys you probably won't touch for a minute because I want to get through some of the other ones because what I'm going to do with the series is because Sonic Chronicles, I didn't, I completely forgot how big that game is. I knew it was going to be big. I didn't realize it would last me from February to June. I didn't realize it was that big. <laughs> Especially those videos weren't short either. Most of them were like an hour long. Like, ah. <laughs> so my plan, at least I'm going to try to do this. I don't know how consistently I will try, how consistently this will work. Because as soon as we go into the games that I've never played, I will not know how long the gameplay is for them. So I'll be judging them based on like how intense I think they will be. So my goal, I'll go intense crazy game to game that won't take as long but is still important we'll do it like that so there will be some kid games mixed in in here because you guys probably saw we do have a disney princess one and originally i wasn't going to get this one because I, I do curse a lot in my videos i'm a, i'm an adult obviously but my girl is in it aurora rose is one of my favorite princesses i'm really annoyed tiana's not in here but i love her and anything of her i will i will absorb and I will take. Hello, Mr. Handsome. So, we are definitely, but this one will be an easier one. Like, this one won't be a super crazy one. On the other hand, <laughs> we have Brave. And, like, this one is gonna be a bit of a bigger game. And the reason why I say that is because this one talks more about the stories of how we'll save the Golden Kingdom. Cool. This one talks about us battling bears and ice monsters. One of my neighbors has a child who's learning how to talk and they scream a lot. The kid's like two. So yeah, that checks out. <laughs> so, heavy game. Calm game. <laughs> but yeah, I, my goal is to play through all of them, but I don't Oh, we are so selling some of these. Yeah, I am selling some of these games. That's okay. So, but I will play with you, you guys the one that I want to go through the most. And some of them, especially if they're like sequels, like with Kung Fu Panda and Kung Fu Panda 2, depending on how long the game is, I might merge the storyline combined for those two, especially if they're a continuation. But if they're actually a pretty big game, I probably will, will dodge on both. But I'm really excited about it. I will do a little bit of research for each one, and I will try my best to like do some fun facts about it, explore the characters, do all that fun stuff. And if they do end up each one being like, they need to have their own series dedicated to it, We'll do that. That won't be a bad thing. But for now, what I will, so what I will be doing is I am working on Sonic Chronicles and like, because right now I'm working on the story explained, then, which I hope will be up soon, and then I want to do characters explained, lore explained, well lore and story are relatively similar, <laughs> and then I'm going to do my review. So I will do my review for each game. That one probably will come out very soon because I want to talk about should you guys get this and what is the game like because I think it's a lot of fun. But again, the reviews will be my opinion, meaning they're not, it's it's how I feel. Does everyone feel the same? No. I, if everyone felt the same, life would be so boring. Nah. So I'm gonna tell you guys my review, I'll give my reasons, and then it's up to y'all. Especially that game is like 20 bucks to get on Amazon, maybe 40. I was lucky, I already had it. <laughs> I didn't have to worry. And there were glitches. Glitches that I didn't show on the game, on the video. I think I might have showed like two glitches. But yeah, I have what I'm, <laughs> this video has no plot line. I am so sorry guys. Well, it does. It's just a lot of chaotic energy and me talking at y'all. <laughs> sorry 
Anyway guys, one of my friends were talking about systems and literally he's like, I can't say shit. And I'm like, what did you do? <laughs> oh my God. Okay, hi baby. But yeah. Originally, I was gonna show you guys all the games that I wanna play for you guys, but I kind of wanna do a little bit more like, <laughs> like I will show you guys as we get there. Cause some of the games I wanna play don't have a storyline. Like, some of them won't, unless the ones I build. Like, for instance, My Farm Around the World, which most likely is a Animal Crossing ripoff. Probably. I don't know. Haven't played it yet. Once I play it, I will tell you guys. <laughs> but some of them definitely will, and some of them won't. For the games that don't have a storyline, I'll do a review. I'll do some fun facts. I'll be like, hey, this is what the game's about. But yeah, so guys, I hope you are okay with this but I am so excited to show you guys and I am and then someday when I get my own computer and like I get more things because I'm, I'm kind of computerless right now um it'll be fixed soon don't worry <laughs> but as soon as like this is actually a monitor I will fix it soon <laughs> we're, we're in the process but as soon as that gets taken care of we will see we will do more fun stuff that I'm super excited to show you guys and eventually someday we will actually do a like one of the actual popular games going on like what I really 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 want to play I really want to play Poppy's Playtime I know it's controversial but Kissy Missy is queen and I love her <laughs> that's kind of my whole vibe like I just love it now to end this video of me being pure chaotic for like 12 minutes give or take I got something for my FNAF collection, which you... I actually have condensed it a little bit. I've been good. I say that, but I bought something else. <laughs> so, at the used game store that I have, they can you can like sell games and like sell merchandise, and they'll give you in-store credit for it, and it's really cool. Yeah, they also sell pops, like those um pop stands. I got spring traps. Wait, I don't know if you guys can see him. One second. Yes, I'm taking him out of the protective case, but he's still going to be in the box. <laughs> Look. I hope you guys can see him okay. Like, this is the 110 Freddy Fazbear, Freddy, on um, Vanessa Freddy's Pop Trap of Spring Trap. I absolutely love it. I wonder, this came out in 2016. Okay, no, the real reason why I bought this, I was talking to the girl. I thought this man has like multiple eyes for a second, like like multiple sets of eyes. And I'm like, uh, sir. But the main reason why I bought this guy was when the girls, these really two incredible women were talking to me and they were helping me with like get my stuff. And I saw this man and he was behind the counter because they were worried they were gonna steal him because this guy apparently is rare. And I'm like, ooh. And I don't actually know if it is, or they were telling me that to sell me. They could probably be doing it to sell me. But literally, I was like, oh my god, is that a spring trap? And she's like, yeah, it's actually the only one we have. And I'm like, really? And she's like, yeah, I'm really hoping someone buys him so I don't buy him. And I'm like, mine. And I literally gotten paid that day. So it was like, perfection. This will be mine now. <laughs> But guys, I am so freaking excited to tell you guys, to for us to go on this gaming adventure journey, because I really like playing video games. And I know it's kind of niche to go through and play all of DS, Nintendo DS games. The main reason why I actually wanted to was because of Sonic Chronicles. I love this game. So the ex having the excuse to go through it and talk about it is so cool. I love this game, and I'm not gonna love all the DS games I play. I know that. That's okay. I don't mind. I'm having fun, and I get, to, and I'm excited that I actually get to talk to you guys and like create this. I'm really excited. But yeah, I hope you guys are having a great day. And next week we will go back to our regularly scheduled gameplay. I don't know if it's going to be. Who do I want to play first? We shall see. Actually, no, I know exactly which game I want to play first because it'll be really fun and I'm really excited about it. So, that's your clue. 
I'll see you guys next week. And thank you guys so much for joining me on this episode of O.Ship 33's show. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>